So April is a very busy time for West Ham, but also it's going to be a very busy time for the London Stadium. We've got six games at the London Stadium. I thought it was only five, Russ. No, it's actually six games. We have four Premier League games. Uh, we have Southampton on the second, Newcastle on the fifth, Arsenal on the 16th and Liverpool on the 26th of April. We also have our quarterfinal second leg Europa Conference League match against KAA Ghent on the 20th. And also we have the FA Youth Cup semi-final match uh, against Southampton. The first time we've reached this stage since 1999. That's been played on Thursday the 6th, the day immediately after the Newcastle game. So if we added up all these attendances, that would be approximately 325,000 people attending London Stadium. Granted, many will be um, attending multiple matches, season ticket holders and whatnot, but still there's a lot of people in the London Stadium in a very short amount of time. Now the Ice Point Food Banks, you may be aware of them. They've uh, been collecting at home games for a couple of seasons now by the Aquatic Centre on the way to Stratford. They collect on behalf of underprivileged um, people in the Newham area as well as surrounding areas to the Newham borough and have been supplying food banks for, for several years now since December 2019, I believe. They are in desperate need for our help. Food banks are being used more and more as the cost of living crisis gets worse and worse and people are turning to food banks just to survive, which means they are needed more and more and they need our help. They need our support and they need our money. Now, if only 1% of those 325,000 people give us a pound and pop it in the buckets for the lads on the um, by the aquatic centre, that would be by the end of the month 3,250 quid. Doesn't sound like a lot, does it? But through our association with the His Church charity, they take you one pound and magically change it into five pounds worth of food. So maybe we end up by April, end of April, with five thousand pounds worth of match day um, collections. That would equate to almost twenty-five thousand pounds worth of food that we could distribute to the most needy in the Newham and surrounding areas. So it only takes a quid to make a massive difference. So that's why we're launching our Bring a Quid campaign, and that starts in April. I've got a few words from some of our supporters in terms of the launch. Hi, it's Declan Myers here. Iron Supporting Food Bank's Bring a Quid campaign launches in April. Please bring a quid for a worthy cause. Hi, I'm Kevin Nolan, and I'm supporting the Iron Fo Supporting Food Bank's Ashtag Bring a Quid campaign this April. Bring a quid to the next home game and drop it in the ISF buckets. Come on, you Irons. So the campaign launches officially in April in time for the Southampton game on the 2nd. We're going to be launching that with a 24-hour live stream on the West Ham Network YouTube channel. That starts on Friday the 31st of March at 5pm in the UK. And obviously we're going on to Saturday. It's all we're ready for the Sunday game. The stream itself will have ex-players, celebrity fans. Uh, we'll have presenters from other West Ham fan channels. We'll have opposition fans on there. There'll be quizzes. There'll be prizes to be won. It will be a really fun event. So we hope that you can join us for that event. But the main focus is our Bring a Quid campaign, which launches in April. Hopefully, you bring a quid to the next game and we can make a massive difference for those less privileged than us. Thanks.